In the northeastern provinces of Afghanistan, five vital bridge building projects have been implemented by the Afghan government in recent years. These projects include the construction of a basic bridge foundation with a length of 33 meters in Kazi Kini village, reconstruction of Deegan Bridge with a length of 30 meters on the coast road, and the construction of a 12 meter steel concrete bridge in Talakan City, Takar Province. Also, the construction and construction project of Marty Kel Gorambi Bridge, with dimensions of 51 meters in Coast Province and 120 meters concrete iron bridge on Narin to Coast Farang Road, are also among the other titles of these projects. These infrastructures are aimed at improving geographic communication, promoting agriculture, and increasing access to basic services. And the development of the Afghan government is considered to be the welfare of the population of different areas of this region. In the framework of infrastructure development and in order to improve the living standards of the rural population, the construction project of a basic bridge foundation with a length of 33 meters in Ghazi Kini village was implemented under the title Construction of the Basic Bridge Foundation in Sarpul, and it was implemented with concrete. This bridge foundation is part of efforts to improve the economic and social situation in the region. This project is designed and implemented with the aim of connecting roads, reducing distances between districts, promoting agriculture, and improving access to services for local people. The construction and construction project of the 12-meter concrete iron bridge in Kucha Komando, Talakan, Takar Province, is a clear example of the Afghan government's commitment to developing infrastructure and improving the living conditions of the local population. This project has been implemented under the supervision of the National Rural Road Building Program and started with funding from the Afghan government. The bridge, with a length of 12 meters and a width of 8 meters, has been restored and restored using high-quality materials and modern technology. This structure has been proposed as a vital point in the center of Talagan, and due to the importance of transportation in the development of the region, it leads to economic and social improvement. The goals of this project include improving access to services and facilitating geographic communication, which is of great importance and contributes deeply to the well-being of the people of Takar province. The 30-meter-long Deegan Bridge construction project on the road of Coast Province, Deegan region, has been implemented as an ambitious step in the direction of developing infrastructure and improving the livelihood of the people. Under the supervision of the National Rural Road Construction Program of the Ministry of Public Works of Afghanistan, this project was started with financing from the Afghan government, and after a few months of work on this bridge, it was completed. Considering the criticality of the current state of the road for the population of Deegan region and Coast Province, this project, in addition to improving geographical connections, is also very important in terms of public benefit. The development of this bridge and the reconstruction of the road are also intended to increase access to basic services and improve the level of population welfare, which with the effective cooperation of the National Rural Road Building Program and the financing of the Afghan government is an important step towards realizing the goals of development and improvement. It is the living conditions of the population of the region. The construction project of the Marty Kelgormabi Bridge, with a length of 51 meters on the Coast Gardiz Road in Tani District, Coast Province, is a very valuable example of an infrastructure structure and represents the commitment of the Afghan government to the development and improvement of living conditions in rural areas. This project, which was implemented by the National Rural Road Building Program of the Ministry of Public Works, with the financial cooperation of the Afghan government, with dimensions of 51 meters in length and 8 meters in width, not only improves and reconstructs a traffic bridge, but also improves the geographical communication and facilitates it provides access to deprived areas. Considering the current state of this bridge and its importance for the population of Coast Province, its reconstruction is considered as a necessary and public benefit project and it is expected that the positive effects of this project will transform the economic, social, and cultural fields in this region. This action is not only a symbol of the long-term development of the Afghan government, but also has a very high value as a strategic tool for achieving the goals of sustainable development and improving the living conditions of the rural population.
The construction and construction project of 120 meters of iron and concrete bridge above Nahrin to Coast Farang Road has started, and its implementation by the National Rural Road Building Program of the Ministry of Public Works, and with the financial cooperation of the Afghan government, is one of the eternal and effective projects in the field of infrastructure and economic development of Nahrin Baglan region. This bridge with dimensions of 120 meters in length and 8 meters in width, not only helps to improve geographical connections and transportation in this region, but also stands as a symbol of the commitment and development of the Afghan government to the welfare of the population of remote areas. The reconstruction of this bridge, taking into account its current state and the basic needs of the people of Beglin province, is considered a necessary and public benefit action and is expected to have a very high impact on the economic, social, and cultural developments of the region. This project helps in the development of strategic infrastructure in Afghanistan and represents the government's special strategy to improve living conditions and accelerate the development process. Afghanistan is known as one of the mountainous countries in the world, with a geography that has many mountains and unique geographical diversity. These mountains, which are spread across the length and breadth of the country, continue from the west coast to the northeast of Afghanistan, and they have a significant effect on the improvement of infrastructure and geographical communication in this region. Despite the beauty and natural features of these mountains, but due to the diverse topography, the creation of crossing routes and road connections in Afghanistan has created challenges. The construction of bridges in these areas seems to be a vital and necessary way, because these structures help in a way arising from the economic and social needs of the local people, transfers, agricultural development, and improving access to basic services. As vital and vertical connections up and down these mountains, these bridges play an essential role in the economic and social developments of Afghanistan and are especially effective in improving the living conditions in the remote and less developed areas of this country. The people who live in the mountainous and rural areas of Afghanistan are facing many challenges, as the majority of the country's population are rural dwellers. These people face a difficult life, limited access to basic services, and research and agricultural extension. However, this scattered and stable population is looking for suitable solutions to improve their lives by using local resources and local knowledge. Among the successful solutions of these people, we can mention the promotion of local agriculture, the development of local handicrafts, and the improvement of access to education. By using local knowledge and experiences, these people have been able to face the challenges of living in remote areas and experience continuous improvement in their living conditions. Thank you for watching.